All right, here's a quick video on uh, getting the, uh, the true type fonts off your Amiga 5.0 CD. And instead of actually putting them into Amiga, we're going to put them onto the Windows fonts uh, system. So, uh, so you can use them in other programs, other sign programs and so forth. All right, so I'll put the CD in the drive. Okay, and uh, Windows then will um, will hopefully come up with a pop-up to say is uh, we've detected a CD and we want to explore that uh, CD, find the font that we want, and then simply install it onto our our system. Okay, like with most of my videos, I just do them in real time. So any time it takes to for the computer to catch up, it will take. Here we go. Alrighty, so. Um, yeah, auto plays come up, so we open the file, do the files, alrighty, and then we're looking for our font directory, fonts, there we go, we open this up. Um, as, a, as a quick um, quick side note, if we go into our library here, I'm actually just looking for, library is not what I want, sorry guys, I'm looking for our catalog, sorry, catalogs. In here, you'll find the URW font catalog. Now, if we actually open that, um, it's quite a large PDF file. However, it will show us a preview of all the fonts that are on this on this CD. So I can go through, pick a pick anything O, that'll do, and I can zoom in here and have a look, and we can see see the name of our font that we've got, and also to um, the location, which is quite handy. So let's say we want to install a particular font. Let's look for, for something something easy. There we go, this, this this Nimbus one will do. This one here, we like this font. So it's telling us it's in N, and then we've got this this number here, uh, 1943D5, whatever that means. So we'll go back to our um, our font CD, and then we'll go through to true type, and then we'll go looking for N, and then we look for N190, etc., etc. Let's have a look. 43, whatever, it doesn't matter, we'll just open this one up. So we double click on it and we can see the preview of the font and all we really need to do is just click install. And this is Nimbus Sand P, that'll do, install. <clears throat> and this will actually now install on our Windows uh, system. So now I can use this uh, wherever I need a, a true type font, whether it be in Microsoft Word or programs like Flexi or, or stuff like that, you can import that font, so yeah basic way to go through and, and, and look at those fonts and we can we can double click on any of these we can look here or we can just double click here have a look at the font make sure it's what we want yeah that looks great click install and then it installs it on our system simple as that cheers